Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Infiltration. So, um, we've got the mechs back, um, and our direwolves back. Uh, once again, I want to try and get some Goss gear for this guy. Um, I tried, so we go a quick refit on this guy. I tried uh, loading him up. I thought maybe, um, it's a weird kind of build. Um, the reason why I say that is that these uh, rotary Goss aren't bad, but if you look, look at it, the, the weapon has a jam chance of recoil times 30%, mitigated by gunnery and recoil reduction, but it's like, it's got a recoil of 6. So, the fire control system HAG reduces that by 1, the pilot itself will probably reduce it by 2 more, so it's going to have a recoil of 3, like, recoil times 30% like it's, it's <laughs> the damn thing is going to jam pretty much every time we use it right so I don't know I'm kind of up in the air I like to hear what you guys think about this we could go with the heavy goss I got the turret mount we could throw it in here um, give this thing a bonus chance to hit now I've only got um, where are we here goss I've only got two tons of uh, heavy goss ammo that's only eight rounds it's not a lot but I mean, we could kind of go this route. Um, I mean, it'll do some good shredding with these. And then, you know, we'll, we, we can put in, um, where is it here? Our exchanger and stuff um, to get rid of the heat problem. Um, but I don't know, I'm kind of up in the air. I mean, we could drop one of these guys and go with something else. Like leave the heavy goss, a couple of these guys, and then something else. I don't know. This is 30 heat, so... I don't know, man. I, I don't know what to do here. So, I'd like to hear what you guys think. I mean, maybe we give this a whirl, see what happens. I don't know. Um, not convinced it's like the best build we could we could go with, but... Um, I don't know. It's it's This thing's pretty much a tank. I'm thinking that both of these, these uh, lone wolves... Fist of Dorn had mentioned that maybe we should try for a uh, closer build and use some of the closer weapons we have. And I was afraid to do that because of the mechs we have. If we put half a lance in, or half of our eight mechs in as four, four mechs, they're going to get targeted by everybody, especially when they're trying to close. But if they're two dire wolves spearheading the, th spearheading the assault um, with tons of armor, I think we might be okay with that. I don't know. Um, but drop any comments in the comment section down below. Uh, what do you think I should load those guys out with? The second one I got, I managed to start repairing it. So it's going to be up and running very shortly as well. It's got four more days before it's back. Then we can start loading stuff into it. we got enough C-bills now to uh, handle the financial reports. I thought I would go ahead. Um, I know I said I wasn't going to take the Pony Express mission against Jade Falcons because I want to get rep back with these guys. But we're not going to do that on this planet. We're not going to get any more Jade Falcon missions, I don't think, on this planet. So... If we take this mission, it's not going to damage our rep too much with them. It's only going to give us minus 7. Right now we're at 16, so it'll be down to 9. Not, not too bad. We can make that up. So we're going to go uh, do this here. Urban uh, Ambush Convoy, 4 Skulls, and take full salvage on this. Because it is Jade Falcon. We're hoping to get some good gear here. Let's bring the second lance down here. Um, Grand Summoner, Mastodon, Workhorse with the Archer. Let's, um, where are you here? The Prime is the laser version. Now I know we've got the uh, larger approved heavy laser. I haven't put that in yet. Um, I might be redoing some of the builds. I'm not sure yet. Uh, let's leave out uh, this Grand Summoner. I think this is the PPC build. Yeah. Let's move the Archer up to the Mastodon. And we're going to give the Loki Prime to Workhorse. We're definitely going to go. I I, I want to make sure we keep that in. If we're going to be, if I know we're going to be facing a lot of guys, I definitely want to keep the uh, the Hades in the battle. Um, just because we want to make sure that we're getting um, um, AMS against the enemy. So let's deploy this and get it done. Command All right, here we go. We're down, and we got support units. Really. Okay. Whatever. Why we would need support units for this, I have no idea. 
Okay. Uh, where are they? That's where they're going, right? That's where we got to see them. So they're probably coming along this way. Most likely going to turn and turn. So we got to go straight up the center here. Yeah, we got to get going here. On my way. Double time. Thank you. Thank you very much. So, I mean, the other thing we could do with the uh, with the dire wolves, the dashies, is we could yes, um, not outload, like, load them out for close range. We could load them out for long range fire. Switching up, like, the... Um, like freeing up the archers and some of our other mechs to uh, be close range mechs because some of these mechs are pretty darn fast like the Orion it's act not, not actually not that bad of speed on this thing right, right. so we can bring in um, you know maybe our 70 like 75 ton 80 ton mechs um, like even the archers are pretty darn quick you know we could switch them out from LRMs to maybe ATMs or something and use them for close range mechs. They've got laser uh, point on each arm so maybe we can put some heavy improved lasers or some medium improved lasers or something on there. It's a possibility. In order to do it though, whatever we end up doing, we're definitely going to need to... Uh, let's Don't get too far up. We're def definitely going to need to um, get a lot of C bills for this. So let's switch these guys on to overload. I don't forget this time. But the two dashes are definitely going to allow us to do way more five skull missions. It's going to open up a lot of potential, which is why I kind of, my first impression was to use them as close range mechs. Because with them at close range and heavier missions with lots of armor on them, like 240 in the torsos, like I think it's like 300 in the center torso or something, it's ridiculous, right? So with them in close, um, they can absorb the hits while our other guys are uh, pummeling people from range. But it's just a thought. I don't know. It's really going to require, I think, a lot of experimentation. But um, somebody mentioned we should be doing... I, I'm sorry, I can't remember your name again. I have, like, the worst memory for people's names. I'll get it soon enough. I think it was something hogue oh my god i'm yep. i wish i could remember anyway they mentioned that maybe we should uh the second dash you should be um um a pulse laser build originally it was like large pulse lasers um but it could be large and medium pulse lasers right but uh the only thing the only problem i find with that in heavier missions is it's just not giving you your i think you're just better off going with atms at that point because the you know the large pulse lasers are doing 17 per hit, the mediums are doing like 11 per hit or something. ATMs with HE are doing 12 per hit. You know, and you're firing more of them. So I don't know. I mean, it's also it's a weight balance and a heat balance thing too, right? So because if we load it down with tons of pulse lasers, we have to have a lot of heat sinking in there. And I just don't have the prototype double heat sink kits to be able to do that. I mean, I guess we could strip out the. Uh, um, the night gear right now that the infiltrator is using uh, we could strip that out and just have it go with um, let's get right up into here see what we're getting here there we go um, yeah thank you we could like I said we could go with a pulse laser build oh my god they're, they're going along here so there's an opponent Pegasus, full armor, Maxim, Maxim, Choppa, 10 ton rapier, Savannah Master, 5 tons, wow. Uh, okay. Holy crap, there's a guy over here too. Well, they said they were fast, so. Um. But yeah, we could strip all that stuff off of the uh, night gear, put it on the dashy for heat sinking, and just load it up with like heavy, like maybe the heavy improved laser. Uh, really, heavy improved lasers or whatever. Like, right just load the damn thing down, 
All right, let's get into battle here. I got it. Don't think. Don't shoot. Just run. Now we need all three of those things. We need all three of those, and wow. Do I hold off? I'm going to hold off in the barrage until we can get a bunch of them together. I know maybe I shouldn't, but... we got a lot of other guys coming up here that can do some damage. Okay, the streak's hit. Beautiful. Okay, duck. Okay, I think we're just going to continue to hammer the guys that I can see. I want to try and kill them early so we know he's gone. He's still going. Reporting, critical hit. Not sure how those missiles made it through those fuel trucks, but whatever. Whatever. Now he's dead. Now you're dead. Oh, he's like got lots of vision. Open my mouth. Oh, we got him. Okay. <laughs> open my mouth. I was going to say open my mouth too soon. But I apparently I didn't. Okay. Get the fuck up here. Good thing my, my heavy mechs are fast, I got to say. What if I should reserve? I don't think so because I don't want to lose initiative the turn after. I don't want to lose initiative the next turn. Because a lot of these guys might go past here. Yeah, see these guys are right, like, this is going to be tricky. That's tricky. It's tricky, 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 tricky. It's fun to kill a Jade Falcon. Convoy on the move. I can't rhyme worth a damn. Oh, man. It's a really terrible jam. I'm going to pound them and go blam. I'm going to eat them up like spam. Gonna spend the evening and cram. <laughs> Gonna have a drink about a dram. I can't think of more any more ams. <laughs> oh yams. Gonna have some yams. Uh, waiting for the choppers to move. It's the it's the uh the uh chopper uh the chopper delay wrap. Because they lag the machine like crap. I like the YouTube channel Brap TV. Oh yeah, AMS boat's not up quite up here yet. Not quite up here yet. Come on, workhorse. Get your ass up here. You know what you gotta do. Wait, what the hell is this one? shooting at. Oh, it's over the building at this guy. That's the Ripper. Where's the five ton? I don't think that's part of the convoy, the five ton Savannah Master. What should I shoot at here? I don't know. Let's just find the best target. 2.2%. 2.2. 2.2. 2 5.8. Epona. Or in the Pegasus. Alright, well. Oh, three hits. Not bad. Not bad. I hope these guys get reinforcements. I should learn my lesson, though. It's like, oh, he's coming after us. That guy's got balls. That guy has got cajones. Look at this guy. He's five tons, and he's like right in there. I do have orders. I want you up right up here. Um, 
What are your chances on the choppers? Probably terrible. Ooh, 11. That's on the fast reconnaissance. It hogs 11. 11. 15 on Epona. 15 on Pegasus. Uh, let's go on the one we just shot at. Let's go after the Epona. Can we use HE on this? Oh, we can't. Okay, well, that's fine. Firing. We're going to save our... Uh, oh, we got two hits. We're going to save our... Um, our... Uh, I don't even know what the hell I was going to say now. Oh, our uh, Warlord. So we get a little closer. It's a waste on a 15% chance to hit. Okay, well we know you're not part of the uh, convoy. I would have thought these reconnaissance vehicles would have been the convoy and the choppers would be the, uh, the guards, but I think it's actually going to be the other way around. Supposed to be a hover tank convoy, but I'm guessing it's the uh, aircraft. Oh, you're just pissing me off, man. You're just pissing her off. Good to go. You uh, show this guy what we're all about. Well, that's a pretty bad sprint. But you are at the back, so. Oh, I think he, I think that archer's got the lighter engine. That's not bad. Nice. Got past the armor. Warning. Armor low. Well, you shot somebody in the back, too. Nice job. He's... He, he, just in his voice. Well, he shouldn't have been standing in the way, then. I don't mind. As long as it's not the full LRM in the back, I'm okay with that. His medium lasers can't do too much. Oh, yeah! That one was a bad one right there. Oh, you got shot in the back? What? That hurt. Wait. Who shot what? We got two catapults back here. You better not fucking... We'll see what happens. Ah, now we're sluggish. Now we're sluggish, but it can't be something. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Spend the money on ammo, not on armor. Come on, Catapult, get that Savannah. Well, somebody's using an arrow. Pair of arrows? What's this guy got? Pair of LRMs. This one's not even worth it, the 15s? And four mediums? Oh, it's just a regular catapult, though. I thought maybe it was a uh, clan catapult, but... LRM 15s are 7 tons each. That's a lot of weight. 14 tons for a 65-ton mech. And that was a whole lot of nothing. Oh, sorry about that, guys. You know me and the camera. We do not get along between turns. Well, at least we go before these guys. That's a good thing. I'm wondering if I should put that uh, battle computer in the other in the other dashy. If we're going to make it a close range mech, having the plus two initiative for everybody in the lance might be a good idea. It's a possibility. Commander. All right, duck. Uh, you're going to reserve. I want to use my direct fire first, if I can. And use the indirect fire for the cleanup if we need it. Just because the, the indirect fire just spreads the, sh the damage everywhere. You're more likely getting... You're more likely to get a lucky uh, strike where you need it with a uh, LRM mech than you are with a laser mech, so. Who are you shooting? The Savannah? No. Oh, he's got an AMS. Never mind. Never mind. Ripper. Okay. Uh, Lilu Dallas? Yes, 
We're not going to get a shot at anybody over there, are we? Let's bring you into here. See if we can pull this Pegasus out of the battle. Chunkily running up here. Wow. I take it back. <laughs> I, I take it back. I forgot how good you are. I'm sorry. I apologize. 33% ain't nothing, ain't nothing for you. It ain't nothing. All right. Let's get uh, Workhorse up. Let's get the AMS into here. I think it's probably good. Where did Savannah go? Did they kill it? Savannah? I guess they did. Uh, where's the Ripper? There you are. 10 tons. Down here, right? Yeah. Fire on this guy. Yeah, so it is the aircraft. Concentrate your fire and bring it down. Uh, you're going to reserve. We're going to reserve. The Ripper's already gone, so I know they can't go out this turn. Balak's going to have a sore butt in a minute. Let's get you up front so you're not shooting people in the back again, please and thank you. Uh, I know I was saving missiles for before, but I think I want to drop your missiles onto the... I was thinking about originally with the uh, on the um, Ripper, but I think we'll drop them here. Wow, terrible, eh? I don't even know if we're hitting. No idea. No idea what we did. Oh, there's a Nidhogg. Okay, we should be able to smash this guy. I'm interested to know if these guys' weapons are considered 360 degrees. Because this guy didn't fire. I don't think this guy can fire at anybody. Because he's facing this way, right? He should have a firing arc up here. But you think with the gunshipper stuff, the guns in the bottom most likely rotate, you know, maybe at least 300 degrees, maybe 360. So they should still be able to fire. Doesn't matter what, like, I mean, at least the main chain gun or whatever's on it should be able to fire. Missiles and stuff like that, probably not, but, uh, you know, you should give it at least the uh, chain gun or whatever is the main uh, nose weapon is, should be able to fire 360. Yeah, see? That's how it should be. It's not even facing us. And that's okay, the opponent's running. Had enough missiles for the day. So we got what? Set five guys left? Yeah. Shred them. Oh, we got hit by a few. I guess that was a Pegasus. A pair of Lerm 20s, probably. Yeah, we got to kill these guys fast. This mission could end up going south if we kill the wrong stuff at the wrong time. I mean, you're still hitting people. Good to go. Want to mind going over there and punching that guy right in the face for me? Understood. Punch him. Punch him right in the face. 32. Wow. 26. This is bad. Uh, let's do... Let's put it right here. Okay, nice shooting. What target? Warning. Oh shit, we all took a head hit. Of course. Uh, 
Oh, Jade Hawk, okay. Oh, they're at the landing site. That's kind of cool. Rifleman? Ooh. What else do we got? A shootist? Super sharp shooter? Night gear? Oh, that's nice. Jade Hawk. And this looks like... Uh, what's it called? I can't remember the name of the damn thing now. I think I had one of these before. I'm trying to think now. It might have been in... Um, I think it was in Night Witches. Thanks for showing up, buddy. Thanks for showing up. It is the Evan Jaguar. Nope, it's not what I was thinking it was. Reporting. Forget the mechs. We gotta kill the vehicles. It's Lightning McQueen! Did we kill the other chopper too? I guess we did. Let's leave this off for now. Um, let's hope we do some good damage on this guy. That's some pretty good damage. This with the tag though. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, we better kill that guy because that friggin' Archer back there is little, you can just see him salivating. He wants to shoot. He's like, I want to shoot that guy. We're all in the way here. Just kill him so he's not shooting at anywhere near us. Uh, shred him. Target confirmed. Of course. Solid connection on that one. Reporting. Can we get a... Don't know if this guy's... Um, don't know if he's part of the uh, transport here. There we go. That can go to B. Uh, I'm going to rack this down to three. I don't think we need a lot on this. All we need is one hit. Wow. Okay, maybe I should let them dialed up. I think those were building hits. Yeah, that just doesn't look like it's a good spot to be. <laughs> I don't want to shoot my guys in the back, not with the heavy... Oh my god. Oh, I'm too close, that's why. All we need is one good hits, though. There's a couple hits. Still not enough, huh? Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Standing by. Alright, duck. Can't multi from there. There we go. There we go. Alright, we're gonna multi target this. Oh we can't. Frig. It's either this guy or this guy. Well, it's going to be this guy. Let's leave the ERs off for now. And uh, let's make sure we get him. Got the angle, the shot. Let's overkill him. There is no overkill, just kill. Alright, that was part of the convoy. Beautiful. So it looks like it's just the Ripper left. The 10 ton. And he can't get that far, so he's going to die. So we can focus on these guys over here now. I think it, well, the Evan Jaguar apparently is supposed to, or the Jade Hawk. Uh, ATM 6s, ER smalls and medium pulses. He's got to get relatively close. Rifleman, there's a lot of Ultra 2s. What does a Nike gear have? Like lasers and stuff, right? Ultra 10, two PPCs. That could be dangerous. Ooh, AC 20. Right, shootist, AC 20. Ooh, this guy's got a pair of Rack 2s. All right, whoever we're shooting at, we gotta like grind them up fast here. Um, let's 
super sharp shooter shooting shots. Let's get rid of this shootist. I don't want this AC-20 firing at us. Let's hammer him. Gonna leave the tag barrage on. Here it comes. Well, at least it didn't hit close to us. Solid connection on that one. Yeah, man. Rifleman should be toasty too. Yep. Not that toasty, but we'll put some heat on him. There's the Ripper. Beautiful. He just pulls up to die. Gotta love that. Gotta love it when they're they're amiable. Now we still have that one, uh, what's it called, um, Ebola guy down below us somewhere. Well, below the camera. He's down here somewhere. Ripper's going to think about it. What can we run with Ripper? Zipper? Um, clipper? Flipper? Dipper? Um, what else? Slipper? Kipper? Ow. Fucker. Screw you! You're gonna join your buddies in this big inferno over here. Okay, we got... I think we've got a, at least one tag barrage left. I think we do. Okay, uh, Hellion... Let's forget the Ebon Jaguar and the uh, other guy for now. Oh, we got a... The Ebola is like way back here. Or Epona, sorry. Not worried about that so much. Roger. Full throttle. Well, thank you. Well, thank you very much. Okay, let's see if we can multi this. You... And the super sharp shooter. Let's grind that up. And let's put this on B. And I'll leave both of these on A. We're going to leave the barrage off for now. Ooh, maybe we can put it on the shootist. No, I don't know if we need to. Nice. No, 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 no. It's okay. You can come here in a minute and get us. Pilot lethal damage. We took his head off. Yes. Well, at least they're not shooting at guys near us. Soften those two up for me. Ultra 2 Rifleman. Can do a couple hundred points damage if it hits with everything. And it's not that bad, but... Like, Ultra 2s are kind of nice. On a 60-ton mech, it's not that bad. A couple hundred points damage at long range. Especially if you got the tracker sensors and that other uh, headgear targeting computer that we have that gives us a plus 3 at, a, at extreme range. So plus 7 to hit at extreme range, plus whatever else you can get for the pilot and all that stuff. Just stand back there and shred people with the uh, Ultra 2s. Or even Rack 2s would be nice. But I don't think they quite have the range. All right, let's see if we can pull some legs here. I want to go back this way. That guy's a little too close for me. But this guy's not. Come on. You know you can do it. There we go. Let's see if we can take this leg. Large improved heavy, that's like 95%. That's why I want to get the other one on here. I think we can do it. We have to pull off an ER large and a medium probably. Uh, I don't know, we'll see. Okay, not, not bad shooting. Good damage, good damage. Not sure how stable this guy is, but if we make him a little more unstable, he might use his turn to uh, try and brace himself. Which I'm not sure why they do that. They should really, like, move and brace. Like, get behind something, you know. But 
the AI is the AI. We can't ask it to be uh, more than what it is. Okay, we don't want to turn too much because of that opponent behind us. Okay, let's apply some damage to this guy. Uh, let's warlord it because we can. I'm not really worried about salvage off this guy. We want to take him down. Whoa, that looked like a lot of leg hits to me. Maybe I'm wrong, but just look that way. Yeah, destabilize him. Destabilize him. How do we do on this guy? Yeah, they were like pretty much all leg hits. Nice. Do you think he can pull the rifleman's leg off? There's the side shot. Uh, no, you need to be further back, I think. Let's just get him into the arc. We're still a little bit unstable, but that's okay. Um, come on. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, we got one hit in the leg. Okay, hip destroyed. Nice. Lower leg destroyed. He's not moving very far now. Workhorse, let's get you. Um... There we go. You can see him now. Beautiful. Put this guy back on overload. I think he was jammed. That's probably why he was turned off. Uh, I'm going to do this just because. Wow, they both hit. We get the leg? We got the leg. Oh my god, dude. Looks like we took his whole side though. Oh well. Whatever. Okay, back into position here. Warlord. Let's give this guy a face full of it. Um, yeah, just give him a face full of it. I want to see if we can destabilize him, like I said, to force him not to shoot. That should probably give him enough instability. Okay. Uh, duck, where are you? Are you? Oh, we might have time to knock this guy down, maybe. On the move. I think we might be able to knock this guy down. Uh, let's leave the ERs off for now. Save a bit of heat. Locked on. I think he's braced, though. That guy's not. Here it comes. Yeah. I'm under heavy fire here. Yeah, man, don't worry about it. Don't sweat it. Waiting for orders. Oh, I don't need to OP this guy. We can just shoot him. He's on the ground. Let's go after the leg. We could go after the head and try and take the head off, but see if we can leg him. It's a little harder to get the leg, I think. And let's move away from that guy. So we can't get a back attack on us. Make sure we stay in the AMS range. Eben Jaguar, Eben Jaguar, you're gonna die a horrible death. Yeah, the Jade Hawk's completely unstable. Thanks for showing up, buddy. It's because he didn't hit you. <laughs> Look at the heat sinking on the night. Like, yeah, I think if we switch switch that around, 
Uh, rotary's down. Oh well. Let's just move over here. And we'll apply some damage to this guy's leg with what we have left. If we can, that is. Uh, leave the barrage off. What do we get? Oh, you blew his engine up. Yeah, but... Oh, God. Oh, a Ultra 2 ammo explosion. Yeah, Fistledorm was mentioning that these guys are just caseless, right? So a lot of them are dying horribly. Or even if they just got regular case and not case 2. Right? Without case 2, you're, you're losing your whole side when the ammo goes off, right? So... Let's take this guy's leg, if we can. He's a little close. Could just back up first. We probably should. Um, back up to here. Oh, we're going to have a harder chance to hit, though. Here? Yeah, we'll lose perfect sighting. We'll, have, we'll just back up to over here. It's a little better. Marginally better. Yeah, not really. Yeah, not really. Engaging target. Wow. Thanks for showing up, buddy. Infiltrator, you're drunk. Go home. Standing by. Uh, where the frig is that opponent? Where the fuck back here? I don't know if you want to chase him down, do you? Somebody's got to do it. Like your prime. Let's just get over here. This guy's got ult the uh, Ultra 10 and the double PPC, so we better start shooting at him. Uh, how good are we for an offensive push here? 75, that's pretty darn good. Let's go after one of the legs. She's at her range right now, that's why. Yes, Commander. No, get in here. Get into the rubble. Be there in a jet. Uh Wow, well, the leg's taking some pretty good damage. We might get lucky with it. I don't know why I can't click and have that work. Yes, Commander. Looked like the tag may have hit because it said one, but it might not have. I don't know. Uh, let's make this guy sad. Yeah, he's not very happy now. He's very sad. You were not very nice to him. Ready for orders. Just making sure everybody stays in the AMS. It's his job. That's all you gotta do, buddy. Drop some lerms on this guy. We're not gonna save much from this guy. Time to shred. Okay, there's our Orion moving up to do a whole lot of nothing. Oh, he's stressing. Now you're stressing. Comes that night gear. Standing right in the fire. Well, it's only plus 10 heat. It's nothing for him. Oof. Ultra 10 hit. Good thing we're in the trees. Or the rubble, that is. Yeah. Good thing we're in the rubble. Receiving you. Let's give this guy a face full of hostility. Taking a critical hit. 
That he has. Don't know why it does this where it doesn't let me move. Oh, that night gear. Confirmed. I feel so sorry for it. Well, not really. Not really. Let's see if we can end this. Gonna go up to this other leg. That was a critical hit. Sure as hell was. He's nice and toasty now, too. Ooh, knock him over. He goes on 10. We might be able to knock him down. Oh, he bailed. <gasps> that couldn't have been any better. If we can get that mech, that would be nice. The weird thing is, though, is... I it's nice having the clan mechs because they're relatively easier to repair. Like the cost overall, if you take a lot of damage, is a lot less. However, the issue, and it's a huge issue, is you cannot mount weapon mounts in the arms. It's a big problem. All right, we're just going to fire open on this guy. Soften him up a little bit. I want this guy gone. I want this guy dead. I want his family dead. I want to be able to go over there and piss on his ashes. What's he got? 21, 37. Let's go up to this leg. Roger that. Yeah. No leg hits, huh? It's completely unstable, though. What's the plan? Think Goofy would be able to knock his ass over without killing him? Have to be care. Oh my God. Ah, uh, we gotta be careful. Okay, let's leave these two off. Switch these back to normal. Uh, we'll leave these on normal. Sure, let's try this. Might get that leg. Looks like we did. Did we? That hit something good. Okay, we got the knockdown. I don't know if it said that got the leg though. We'll find out in a second here, I guess. Okay, start heading this way. As you wish. Yeah. What's up, boss? Did not get the leg. Oh, this one's at zero, though. So we did. Kind of. The shot. See if we get lucky. Come on, bail out, buddy. He did. Thank you. He listened to me. I like it when that happens. Ready for orders. Uh, well, this mech is still up. We can't attack anybody else. Let's get up in here. Yep, let's give him some love. A little bit of LRM-70 love. Bulwark, looks like. It's not going to save you. Not going to save you. Come on, Balak. Do something. Do something spectacular. They are down to two. Oh, they're still going, huh? Yes, Commander. Affirmative. Let's chase this guy down. I have no idea where he is, though. I mean, he was back here. Oh, there he is. There you are, hiding in the bush. He's like hiding right in the corner. 
Sure. I have no idea how many escorts are left. It might, might just be that guy. Well, it seems kind of weird because I don't remember killing that many extra vehicles. I thought about coming in here with a reduced lance. It's a good thing we didn't because they probably would have made it to the exit. At least some of them would have. Ow. Well, you want to play the ra the uh, mass fire game? We can play the mass fire game. We can play it even better than you can. I like them apples. I wonder if this would be a kill. Can't choose his head. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to destroy the rack. I mean, we've already got a rack too. There you go. So there's our rack. If we want it. Can you get close enough to drop some lerms on this guy? No, he's still too far away. Still too far away. Let's get rid of your uh, instability. Commander. Maximum speed. Still out of range, huh? Where is he? We lost him? We're getting closer to him when we lost him. Sure. There you are, you little bugger. Come on, you got the arrows, you should be able to hit them. Just making her mad. I'm taking some serious hits. Order. Orders. It's a race to see who can get the last kill. You got some indirect. Can you? Oh, you can hit him. Beautiful. It's already taking a tiny bit of damage, but maybe we can apply some more. There you go. Everybody's in for that last kill. Let's try and get as close to other guys over here as we can. There we go. Get those AMSs up. Pair of lerms. Yeah, I think it was a much better choice putting the LRMs on that guy. I mean, we're not getting a lot of damage in the indirect fire, but it's, you know, it's enough. It's a good thing you didn't steal my kill. Oh, you got your warlord. See if we can claim this guy. I'm on it. Is he yours? Yep, there you go. Alright, let's go home. Mission successful. Alright, contract payment increased by 35%. So we do make a you know okay C both. I think some of that'll be going out for repairs. Orion did take a bunch of damage. Some of the other mechs did too. Ah, little bit in uh, what do you want to call it um, not a good uh, spread of kills here um, yeah a lot of our pilots took one injury I'm not exactly sure what the hell happened with that there's those weird building explosions I think that just mechs take shrapnel in the head I have no idea why so we have three neck gear prime parts if we want it gonna drop those in for now and there's the Jade Hawk I think that is really Blankberg ER laser. I mean, like heavy Gauss rifle. Ah, 
Now, I think we're going to take these. I could go through here and get jealous of the other stuff that's down here, but if we don't end up using these mechs, we definitely will um, put them together and sell them. Uh, yeah. Oh, man, no CEWS, really? Track your senses. Well, let's hope we get some of this stuff. All right, let's just confirm this. All right, we got a shooters part, Refman 2C part, ERPPC clan, uh, medium pulses, medium X pulses. Uh, I did I did sell those before, but now we've got a couple back. Uh, a couple of cores we can sell. Guardian ECM. Oh, we got the tracker sensors. That's nice. 2AC 20 ammo. Eh. Oh, nice. Heavy Gauss double. That's beautiful. That's excellent. We, de we definitely needed that. Uh, okay. Oh, rack 2 double. Okay. Not bad. Ah, 415. Wow. Alright, well. It is what it is. So I was just thinking as we were loading back. What might be a good... Oh, Christ, out for 11 days, eh? 14 days? Spoiler, no big deal. Okay, we might... Ah, uh, really? Um... Let's have a look here. Uh... Is there a mission we can do in a few... Like this... Hot landing is a heavy lance. Three and a half. We could do it... Uh, I don't want to do the convoy mission. It would have to be this one. Uh, most likely probably two lances, maybe three lances. How many guys could we have up and running by then? Let's manage our tasks here. See what we could get back. Well, the Zeus we definitely want back. Uh, the Archer can stay out. Archer 2. I think both night gears are probably a good idea. Got to get it inside 11 days. So these guys, let's put you up there. Three days for the Hades. Let's get the Hades back. Orion, 10 days, huh? Die Wolf in four. Archer two. Grand Summoner. Yeah, we'll go this route, I guess. Let's bring the Dire Wolf up. Here's what I was thinking. Let's go to Mech Bay real quick. Um, I'm thinking that, if you go to storage real quick, we might want to assemble both of these guys at 75 tons and remove the Grand Summoners. There's 70 tons of pop. This is increasing by 5 tons. Uh, Um, yeah, this is the, that's got the ATMs. This one is the ERPPCs and Ultra 10. Yeah, I think we can probably, we got Hellbringer parts too. Actually, let's ready the Hellbringer. I didn't realize we had enough Hellbringer parts. Let's bring this guy forward and we'll scrap it. One part left. Doesn't cost us anything beautiful. Because that that'll give us our financial report. I was kind of getting a little concerned about that. Uh, let's refit real quick. See what it's got. I mean, I really, I don't really care that much. LBX-10, cluster ammo, EP Gauss, rifle, Angel, ECM, ERPPC, double heat sinks. Nothing, well... Endo steel, ferrofibrous. Okay, let's scrap this guy. Should get close to a million for this. Oh, 1.8. Yeah, never mind. That's nice. Take that for sure. Okay, so we've got enough for our... Let's manage our task then here. I wonder...
if we go this route if we get the night gear back we can switch everything over to the grand there are the uh, dire wolf you know what let me think about this between episodes I'm gonna end this episode here we might end up going to a new planet after this um, there's still some missions here that we could take, but if we're going to have one of the two direwolves into play, I mean, I guess we could still stay here. There's forward observers at Five Skull. It's a city battle. City battle. It's against Jade Falcon. I don't want to do that. This is against pirates. This is against pirates, I believe. Yeah. Uh, let me think about it between episodes. I might, e I might stay here. I might not. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I think my plan is to outfit the second direwolf with all the long-range lasers that we have on the night gear. Yeah. And we'll see how that goes and use him as a long pinpoint. We'll use the second one as a close-in mech. But let me think about it. I'm going to end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you got any suggestions for mech loadouts, please drop it in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.